2 plus 2 4 8 4 plus 4 8 8 plus 8 I don't know You don't know? <laughs> oh boy, this bucket of hot chocolate sure looks delicious. Wait Shrek, don't drink that. It's been expired for weeks. Ah, it'll be fine. Ugh, that smells awful. Are you feeling okay, Shrek? I've had better, but at least I won't have to worry about constipation for a while. Peach, I have a question for you. Will you be the mushroom to my kingdom? Oh, Toad, that's so sweet. But don't you think we're better off just friends? Plus, I'm already seeing Mario. This is the worst mistake you've ever made. What are you doing, Toad? Luigi, I didn't see you there. I'm just burying some old memories. Memories? That wouldn't happen to be Princess Peach's necklace you're burying, would it? I can explain. Oh, I'm sure you can. The question is, will I find it believable? We need to find some more of that Mulan, Sichuan teriyaki dipping sauce, Marty. Uh, H. Hey there, Freddy. Nice pizza place you got here. Why, thank you, Morty. We pride ourselves on our delicious pies. Yeah, I, I can smell them from miles away. But, uh, what's going on with those animatronics over there? Oh, nothing to worry about, Morty. Just some, uh, technical difficulties. Gulp. Th they're not gonna come to life and, like, attack us or anything, right? Of of course not, Morty. We have strict safety measures in place. Nothing to fear. Yeah, I'll believe that when I see it. You know, sometimes I wonder who came up with the idea of red sparkly glitter. I hear you, man. It's like the devil himself created that stuff. I can just imagine him cackling in his fiery pit, saying I'm going to make every craft project a nightmare. And the worst part is, it never goes away. I'm pretty sure I've had glitter stuck to me for months now. That's why I refuse to use it. I don't need the devil's handiwork following me around everywhere I go. Okay, little chicken, it's time for me to eat. Uh, Steve, could we maybe talk about this for a sec? Talk about what? I'm kinda hungry. Well, you see, I was hoping you wouldn't kill me and maybe spare my life. Um, that's awkward. I mean, I need to eat to survive, and you are looking quite delicious. Yeah, I get it, but, maybe you can have some carrots instead. Those are pretty good too, right? Yeah, but I already have my heart set on chicken tonight. Sorry, dude. Oh well, worth a shot. I just changed my Wi-Fi name to WFI to her, get it? Oh, how clever. Mine is, pretty fly for a Wi-Fi. Well, at least mine is better than my neighbor's. Theirs is, get off my land. You're speedy Sonic, but I'm the king, my game's classic, it's the real thing. You might be boss, but I'm way cooler, fast and funky, like a golden ruler. My game's pure gold, all of the world knows it, your game's just a copy, don't try to oppose it. You've got pipes, but I've got rings, there's no denying, Sonic's the king. Yo, green guy. You know what I was thinking? We need some rainbow friends in our squad. Bro. What even are rainbow friends? You mean like, unicorns? Nah dude, I mean like friends of all kinds of colors, you know? Like, LGBT plus peeps, people of different cultures, all that cool stuff. Oh okay, I get you now. Yeah man, our squad could use some diversity and inclusion, for sure. Exactly. Plus, rainbows are just cool, so why not have some rainbow friends? Agreed, let's get on that. We'll be the most woke squad in the game. Alright noob, let me teach you how to make a C4 bomb. It's as easy as baking brownies. Really? That sounds too easy. Yeah man, all you gotta do is mix some fertilizer and fuel oil, then shape it into a nice round package. Boom! You got yourself a homemade bomb. Wow, that's so cool. I can't wait to blow something up. Ahem. I think we need to label this conversation with a do not try this at home warning. 
Hey Sans, I heard you got an N-word pass. Is that true? Yeah, man. I can finally say it. Nougat. That's not the N-word, Sans. Oh, my bad. Nutella. No, that's not it either. Oh, I know. You stupid n- I bro, I think I got the N-word pass. What? I don't know, someone just slid it into my DMs. Do you want to try it out together, bro? What the hell, Sans, that's absolutely not okay, and besides, I'm already cool enough as it is. Okay- You stupid n- You know, Foxy, sometimes I feel like people treat me differently because I'm a skeleton. Pfft, that's nothing. You should try being a fox in this world. Everyone thinks we're sly and sneaky just because of some old stereotypes. Yeah, well, at least you haven't been called a bag of bones in a derogatory way. Oh yeah? Well, at least you don't get hunted for your fur. Wait, why are we comparing our struggles like this? This is absolute insanity. Yo, Red Crewmate, you wanna know something wild? What's up, Sans? I love putting meat in my mouth. It's like a party in there, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I think I'll pass on that invite, Sans. Thanks though. I'm not racist, I'm just misunderstood. Misunderstood? You're as racist as a piece of rotten wood. Yo, hold up, that's just not true. Yeah right Waluigi, you make even a Trump supporter feel blue. Oh no you didn't Sans, you've crossed the line. Sorry Waluigi, not sorry, racism is a crime. You stupid n- Yo, Baldi, have you ever heard of people making bank from selling pics of their feet? What? That's just weird, Sans. Nah, man, it's a legit hustle, and your feet are looking real fresh. You could make some serious dough. I don't know, Sans. That just seems kinda strange to me. Trust me, dude. You gotta embrace your inner entrepreneur. Let's get those toe picks on the gram and watch the cash roll in. Yo noob, I got a bone to pick with you. I wanna slurp on your pungent little toes, dunk him in some barbecue sauce, and chomp down. Bro, what the actual fudge? That's some twisted sh asterisk t, keep your freaky foot fetishes to yourself, sans. To bad time to get sucking. Ladies and gentlemen gather around. Today I'm here to discuss the most fiery topic of all, spontaneous human combustion. Oh, um, excuse me, but isn't that just a spicy urban meat? Ha, <laughs> I see you're sizzling with skepticism, my verdant friend. But picture this, imagine wearing a flame-retardant onesie labeled combustion approved. So, you're saying we should all dress like human candles? That's hot. Me some Skittles, but I didn't want to pay for them. And then one of the store attendants came up to me and was like, Put that back! And then he grabbed my arm and I said, Don't touch me! Why are you so hot? What? No, like, I'm touching you and I'm melting. What? I'm, I'm, I'm melting! <laughs> hey, Patrick, have you tried the new Grimace shake? Yes, SpongeBob, I did. Let's just say it's a mix of terror and stomach acrobatics. Wait, so it's like my face after watching a horror movie? Even scarier, it's like my attempt at being a chef. It's a real recipe for disaster. Ha ha ha. I can almost hear the screams of those who tried it. I can't wait to try it. Hey, Mario, let's try this new Grimace shake. Sounds epic. Are you sure, Sonic? I mean, remember when we tried that radioactive chili dog? It nearly burnt our spines off. Oh, come on, Mario. We're heroes. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, uh, us? Well, at least we're fast as lightning on the way to the afterlife. Yeah, we'll make quite the pair in plumber hedgehog heaven. Neo, you ready to find the truth about the Matrix? Sure, but uh, what's this Grimace shake you mentioned? Choose Grimace Light, and it's a sugar rush of reality. You'll wake up in your bed and go on with your life but pick the Grimace shake and I'll show you how far the rabbit hole goes. And remember, all I'm offering is the truth. I'd rather unalive myself. You are watching a master at work. Hey, Sans, what do you say we start our own podcast? Sure, a podcast where we offend everyone and get more hate mail than the entire internet combined? Exactly. We'll call it the Insult Brothers, guaranteed to make friends and ruin careers. Can't wait to see how many listeners we'll have. Zero, or maybe negative zero. Ooh, a sandwich! Bro, chill! Stop! That's too much. No! Ew, what are you putting on it? Cheetos! Now you're deep frying it. No! Oh, that actually looks pretty good. Oh,
Hey, Shrek. Have you tried the new Instagram threads? Donkey told me about it, but I'm not sure if it's my thing. I'm more of a Twitter kind of guy. Ha ha. You'd be the first ogre with a Twitter handle. Hashtag Shrektastic. Watch out, Mario. Soon I'll be hopping castles and tweeting in rhyme. Hashtag Ogreshwal. Bring it on, green machine. But remember, in the kingdom of social media, I'm the plumber with power-ups. Hashtag it's a Mario. Hey, Mr. Beast. I heard you're giving away money. That's right, Mario. But you'll have to do something crazy to earn it. Okay, I'll eat a whole spaghetti bowl in one bite. Uh, Mario, that's not exactly crazy. Fine, then I'll rescue Princess Peach blindfolded. Mario, that's just being a regular plumber. Nice try, though. How about I murder you, you filthy nit? Hey, Sans, have you heard about the new Skibidi toilet? Skibidi toilet? Is that where you can flush with a little Skibidi bab bab dance move? Nah, it's an internet cartoon about toilets singing some song and people with cameras on their heads fighting. Well, as long as it doesn't make you have explosive diarrhea, I'm in. The fuck? Have you heard of the mystical garden of Ban Ban? Oh, you mean the place where all the plants have impeccable dance moves? That's the one. The plants there can salsa, tango, and even breakdance. It's a leafy party. Well, I guess it's time to leave everything behind and join them for a groovy garden boogie. Go outside. No. Why? The sun is a deadly laser. So, Sonic, we're speedsters, but let's have a speed debate. Cats or dogs? Cats, dude. They're too fast for a plumber like you. But hey, can your dog get itself out of a locked castle? Didn't think so. Woohoo. You're quicker with your words, but dogs bring the wolf factor. They'll fetch my victory, Sonic.